y'all. We're keeping the party going. This is Blackout the Rebel, Street Chemistry, Rebel and Rose Entertainment. What you just missed was us getting off the money train. So I'm going to have these dudes introduce themselves. For those of you who don't know who they are, we're going to get right into it. Yo, my name Flock Tanner, man. I'm from Hollis Avenue, Southside Jamaica, Queens. But I'm from both of them motherfuckers. I was raised down south, and I'm here to support my motherfucking family, my children, and my motherfucking mama, my nigga. 100, nigga, money train. Yeah, you already know. It's your boy K-Swag. We in the building. You know, last time, last show, it was like 10 of us. Right now, it was only two of us. You know, my other girl, LT, she just killed the stage. Flex, Lady Flex, supposed to be here. I don't know where she at, but hey, we killing it all, all the way. You already know. All aboard is that money train. Okay. So y'all did a numerous amount of different songs. Uh, what proposed you guys to do that type of selection? Like, what went into the, like, oh, we should do this song? And was like a certain order that you guys wanted to do it in? Well, we got like, you know, we got different, you know, different type of tracks. We got tracks for the ladies. We got tracks for the turn up crowd. You know, the tracks for the chill, calm, cool, collective crowd. So, you know, we switch it up for, you know, for everybody. Everybody likes it, you know. So, so, <clears throat> I mean, we just doing this shit for our motherfucking family. We doing it for our team. We we read that all the ball money train all day team body bag you know the slogan I got it tatted on me it's my bro rep CEO money train it's his shit right here you feel me so at the end of the day all we trying to do is move our family out the hood I don't know what y'all niggas trying to do but that's what we trying to fucking do you hear me real nigga shit hey you can't you can't argue with that all right so you guys put on an amazing performance like you guys have been doing this like you're very seasoned. Vets, um, what would you say goes into making a good performance? Like for any artist out there that's looking up to you guys, it's like, yo, I want to do what you guys are doing. Um, so if y'all want to look into a good performance, you need to just watch us because we're the most talented. As you see, I'm up on stage jumping around here and there, here and there. Everybody like this. Nigga, cut that shit the fuck out, nigga. Money straight here, nigga. We up on all this fucking way, nigga. That's what we do. That's a good performance. I want your motherfucking man, husband, wife, come sit, relax, take a drink, eat some food, and watch Money Train perform. That's what I want to do. You know what I mean? Enjoy your session. Hey, the, the, the main part of it is getting the crowd involved. You know, you got to hype up the crowd. You know, do shit that they like. They like it, the world like it, you feel me? That's what it's about. Okay, so, for all of those out there who are trying to get on the money train, is there any more stops? Is there any more projects coming up that we should all know about? If so, what are, what are they? Hell no, it ain't no motherfucking stops for no motherfucking people. But first, if your ass ain't getting no motherfucking money, you can't get on the motherfucking money train, nigga. You ain't working no motherfucker down to five, nigga. You ain't getting on the money train, nigga. That's it. That's all I gotta say. My oh, bro, he's wild, but nah. If you got talent, hey, all aboard, we go and rock together. Let's make music. That's what it's about. You feel me? Next stop, you already know. Like you heard it here, man. Black out the rubble, money train, they ain't stopping. So you can't get on, really. Ain't no transfers, ain't no nothing. So Rebel Rose Entertainment, Street Chemistry, Black out the rubble. Yeah.
or can I say? Um, let's go.
Thank you. I go by the name of LT. What's going on, y'all? Blackout the Rebel, Rebel Rose Entertainment, Street Chemistry. By now, you already know what time it is. So, standing next to me, I have the first and only female of the night, and she definitely held her own, shut the whole stage down. I'm gonna let her introduce herself, where she's from, and everything like that. How y'all doing? My name is LT Donaldson. That's LT dot D O N A L D S O N. Um, bring it back to you. Sure, if you want to. Okay, so being the only female on the card, usually that kind of happens in the underground hip hop world for some reason. Do you feel any type of like trepidation? Like, are you scared? Are you nervous? Like, you don't know how that crowd's gonna embrace you? Like, or do you just go in there with stride? Or do you take it like, I'm the only female, so I'm definitely gonna get all the props. I'm gonna definitely turn up. So, how do you take it? Well, first of all, I'm going to say I pray. I pray before every performance, believe it or not. I pray before every performance. But like you said, it is. It's kind of intimidating, but not because uh, I'm, I'm not your average female artist. I'll tell you that. I speak real things, okay? I speak real things, and I think some people are... Mostly dudes are intimidated by that, you know? They don't expect to hear that from females. They expect to hear, you know, sex or, you know, uh, bags and, nah. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you how it is. I'm gonna tell you my struggles too, you know? Females have uh, different point of views also. But not really intimidated, but um, let's say I expect the best think of the worst, the opposite, what they say. <laughs> but I do come to kill it every time. You feel me? <laughs> I do. Yes, and that you do. If you guys haven't seen any of her performances, you should go look them up. She definitely does her thing. Heels and all, like if you can look down, she can lift with a skirt. Heels and all, she was two-stepping. It was, it was going down. So, um, like, image-wise, like, how do you feel like the industry is going to try to take you? Because these days, it's kind of like how you say, like, they want, like, a packaged, like, sassy kind of thing. Like, everybody's trying to go for, like, the Nicki Minaj route. And here you are, kind of like a light-skinned Lauren Hill. Like, you've got beauty, but you don't let that be the forefront of who you are. Like, you actually have real lyrics, and you have things that you really want to say. So how do you feel that the industry is going to embrace you? Like, you think you're going to have to change who you are, or are you going to say, fuck that, you're going to go your own route? Yeah, of course, they're always going to try to change you, but um, I'm going to just go off how I feel and what I want to do. And you mentioned Lauren Hill, that's funny. Um, I'm kind of different because I love, it's crazy because I love trap music, but I do love that Lauren Hill soft side. I'm very soft on the inside, but hard on the outside. You feel me? <laughs> so they, they are going to try to change me, but I'm going to do me at the end of the day. That's why, that's all I can say. I could do me. I'm glad you answered that that way because we don't want you to change at all. Like, take it for somebody who appreciates real music and somebody who's really a good performer. Nothing about you should change. Outfits, maybe. That's about it. Outfits and hair. So, um, last but not least, like, do you have any projects coming up? And can, where can we find you? Where can we get more of our LT Fix? Yes, actually, I had to push my project back. Um, but it will be coming out in the winter. I got something for the lovebirds, you know, cuffing season coming up. So we got we to gotta do something for the lovebirds, you feel me? So I would say, like, November, December, I will have, I'll be dropping a single also with a video. And then a small EP, like four or five songs. Just look out for that. And um, the No More, I got to do a video to that. That's going to be an interesting video. Okay, guys, well, you heard it here first. This is Blackout the Rebel with the lyrical, lovely, luscious LT. Rebel Rose Entertainment, Street Chemistry. We're out. And shout out to the Love of Lyrics and Money Train. They always do it for me. They always do it big for me.
y'all yeah, real chill tonight. <laughs> Coming up next to the stage, we got HMY in the building. What, what? Oh. HMY. Oh, but they, they got a lot to say about these guys. HMY, come here, come they here, come here. They just got attitude. Y'all chilling back there. Yeah. They got that attitude. Vibe. That's what you know you're not. You come through, you come through and just say, hey, what? Let me have what? something. How's everybody doing? Just pulling up on y'all, pull up to the front, pull up to the back. We just from Queens, New York. We represent this area right here. Hold it down. And now we got like a new single that's popping. It's in town. New York. They playing it everywhere. Power 105, soon to have. It's one of them. 97. Things of that nature. But I pulled up for my people, so we're gonna make sure we do what we said we can't really do. Oh. 